Hell of a setup they have here. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. place like this. Originally, I was stationed in the Ethan system as part of our rear guard subunit. We did some scouting missions, but really not much else. How many were you? Around 12. Some died, some became outlaws. Two pals and I got out before the war got really ugly. This is where we ended up. Feels like the edge of the universe. It isn't, but if you squint, you can see it from here. out there? Don't know. I got this marker jumping around on my display, though. Could be it. Try to follow it and keep me posted. By the way, if you need better tech, there used to be a trader around that area. Calls her shop the Flying Duchess. Maybe worth checking out. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, last night I kind of convinced myself that it wasn't like... But, after talking to the person that ended up following me last night, it was found out to be pretty worth it, not gonna lie. Very fun. Reminds me of Chorus, which I had a lot of fun streaming and playing. Um, and this is good. Download the logbook. The war is over. You're on your own now. Dang. Yeah, thanks, you privileged people. The Okar blew up Paleon Station, and suddenly all, all you five-star cowards can talk about his truce and how this war was just one big mistake. Well, no scrap. But you sure made a lot of people die for it. I don't care what happens next, if the Okar are suddenly our friends or not, but I'm hell-bent on coming back on, out on top. So I set up a freighter near Nemeris and stocked it with uh, as much war loot as I could find. I even pimped it out with a bunch of lizard tech. To hell with your treaties. You ran, so don't expect us to play by the rules. All the scrap is iron. Yeah? Looks like the pilot never made it back to his freighter. Huh. It may still even be there. I'm gonna go and... loot something. So there's a traitor here as well. Oh no, I'm going to the flying dishes. Not the Dutchman, the Duchess. Oh, would you look at that? Customer or outlaw? Customer, I guess. But can't you be both? 
Not here at the Flying Duchess, you can't. I operate an honest business. I see. Say, you look like you could handle yourself very well in a situation. Reed Are you up for some wimp. challenges? Hunting outlaws in a more creative way. I'll even throw in some reward for you. What do you say? Let me take a look. Challenges. Okay. Affected by an EMP. Drones of missiles. Webster's while not webbed. You try. That's the hangar. I'm good on repair. Charges weapon and boost energy increase the energy's core output. That's cool. Shop you, right? Okay. 3100. Yeah, I don't have that. I don't got any money for that. Solar panels, though. Low demand. So it's cheap to buy here. Freaking out. There it is. There it is. Let's go. Found it. It's infested with hydras. That could explain the weak signal. Second one's up. Bam. Nice. One more and the show is on. Okay, not much else here. So, let's, uh... Dude, bomb. Cole's not looking good. I better get to a hangar and get it fixed. They are indeed bombs. So let's jump to the next one. I just I just jumped through asteroids. That's the thing about space. How do you know if you're gonna hit an asteroid in light speed? And then you just die. I like call them bean bags. <laughs> that was Maddox's idea. So they make our indicator jump around like bean bags getting juggled. Juggled? Man, you obviously never had to endure shift duty. Hey, Station AI, give Adam all the data you have on juggling. Affirmative. Huh, didn't know we had access to an AI. We had it, until I just repaired it. Cool. And, uh, who's Maddox? Not just a moron I used to surf with. Scrap, the filter's rattling again. Talk to you soon. So the signal disruptor is there. So this is a bubble plan. So I just have infinite gas. Found one of your beanies. Looks like an asteroid bumped off half of its antennas. Maybe we're lucky and they got caught up somewhere. Hey, try running a hollow scan to simulate the crash. And what do you think I just did? Smart man. There's one. There it is. If the joints are up for it, you don't have to be a quark mechanic to reattach them. Fits. Ok, 
Okay. Hey, I'm trying to do some repair work here. here and then turn around and go this way and there's the other one Eventually, it will make its way. That's pretty cool. Good as new. All beam Bam. bags are back online. You can see that. Our base marker is now everywhere but here. You can come back to base now. I found something that can make life a lot easier for you. Energy sphere dispenser? How do I get inside? That's how. What the heck? Yeah, let's uh, get that. Okay. Nice. Okay, so I got what I needed to do here. Up here, then reassess to Station AI. Do you like affirmative? Good. They can cross search on <laughs> Maddox and Dax. They don't know their last names. Found multiple mentions in the Ethan mutiny. Second Lieutenant Dexter Dax Bashar is facing murder and desertion charges after the death of First Lieutenant Gabbard Voigt. It is believed he was assisted and is still accompanied by Lieutenant Henley Maddox, transferring full entry to pilot log. A mutiny, huh? Dang. I'm guessing he's innocent. Check this out. While going through some old junk, I found some protective plating for your ship. Might give you an oh. edge in an upcoming fight. I put it in our storage. Okay. Let's it's equip it. Installing a plating item gives your ship armor. It protects against energy damage. The second layer of protection after your shield has been depleted. Once your armor reaches zero, the whole of your ship. Repaired. Okay. 
I wondered how long it'd take for you to look me up. They say it was a mutiny, that you killed your superior officer. I didn't kill him, but I didn't stop it from happening either. That war, the things we all did, it wasn't right. My friends and I, we had a plan to get out and make it all mean something. But Voight was hell-bent on stopping us. And there I was, thinking plans were for fools. Never said I wasn't one myself. Look, I know how hard it can be to trust someone. Maybe you'll find it easier if we focus on fixing up your friend and see where it goes from there. It's really all I'm asking. All right, let's start by oh, having yeah. you head over to the Union Bridge Station and buy something called a Prime Sense STA. That's an old but untrackable scanner module. With it, we can finally see the entire system without the fleet seeing us back. And then? We use a scanner to look for a medical station. We loot the place, beef up our med bay, and let the medical AI patch up your friend. What if there are no medical stations around? Cedo isn't that small. We're bound to come across something. I was hoping for something more solid. Well, all right. What's the name of that scanner? Uh, Prime Sense STA? Correct. Have some faith, and I promise it'll be worth your while. Okay. Inventory ship. Okay, let's upgrade this. Liquor. I should probably equip. Blaster is way better. this launch again and then head out back to Union Ridge keep in mind the fleet may still be looking for an illegal clone so when you talk to the trader try to be as boring as possible I'm flying a stolen combat ship. Why, you'll think of something. An illegal clone? I feel like all clones are... I definitely have talked to him. I've been inside the shop. I'm looking actually. for a Prime Sense STA. 
That's the pre-war model. Quite rare, but I do have one in stock. How much is it? 4,200. 4,000? And 200, yes. Say, you don't happen to be a contractor, do you? Uh, no, I'm just uh, into tech like that, that's all. That's too bad. I could have paid you 2.5k if you'd done a little job for me. All you would need to do is deliver a small package to a dear customer of mine. Really? That's it? Will you do it? Sure, why not? That doesn't sound very committed. I would be grateful if you'd let me take this job. Good. You'll find the package at the abandoned station nearby. I'll give you further instructions once you're there. Seems a little sketchy. What? I need the money. Teleporter. situation here. Pilot has his lair in Rodia orbit. I would be very grateful if you could get my package back. This will cost you. How about a raise up to 3.5k? Sounds fair. I'm on it. Okay. Must be the first. 
freighter mentioned in the log entry. This is definitely the way in. The wreck dates back to the war. How can it still have so much power? <laughs> Whatever they fed the generator, it's still pumping. So through that wall. Cargo unit. <clears throat> Organ enables you to dismantle equipment. Dismantling equipment will give you parts that can be used to craft and modify items. Okay. So let's get. Now we're good. talking. Nice. So for some reason. some reason <laughs> Do I have a map? Yeah, let's go to Rodia
pause it. Can I pause it here? I can, so I'll be right back.
stress call there too. Dang. like everyone else. But with this, I'll prove them wrong. I will finally stand out. I <laughs> warned you. Hey, it's me. Did the package contain some Viridian paint by any chance? Yes, that's it. The recipient is already waiting for you at the outer rim. You know that Viridian products are illegal. I'm sorry, but I'm not paying you so well to ask questions. Point taken. Bam. Containers. More plating. Okay, cool. game is just jump in here jump in there jump in here jump in there I'm sure this is still just um, tutorial stuff because I'm still getting stuff about plating so just kind of travel Gotta travel. You're enjoying this, the viewer. It's a different movie. Uh, are you the guys I'm supposed to meet? You have the package? Yeah, here. This paint job will finally make us stand out. They will see that we're not like everyone else. Am I the only one who prefers to not stand out around here? Time to head back to the trader. Interesting. Next, there's something right here. I do most games uh, after I've played them for like 30 hours. I delivered the paint. Everywhere. Very good. Say, about those customers of yours. They were two madcaps, a scout, a sniper drone, and an elite viper pilot. Yeah, they're quite the raggle-taggle group. It's really hard not to like them, isn't it? 
They're exactly the same as the guys you just made me fight. Nah, there's yeah. a big difference. Return to my shop and you'll understand. Hey, it's almost the exact same thing. It's kind of weird. <laughs> so <it's> sad. <laughs> there's people in the ships. That's the thing. Excellent job. Here are your credits. Great. Oh, and one more thing. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. When the two Viper pilots came by to order the paint, the first one just barged in, slammed his money on the counter, and made his proposition. While the other one began by asking if it was okay for him to dock here. When I said yes, he thanked me. Can you believe that? That's, uh, amazing. Life out here is cruel and violent. Barely anyone treats their neighbor as their equal. So just hearing a friendly thank you every once in a while means something to me. Sometimes it's the small things that really make us stand out. Uh, okay. yeah, right. Well, thanks for the creds, I guess. You're very much welcome, my friend. New decal. Barely have enough, but okay. Let's see, let's help us to 600 meters to the board. One pre-war system scanner coming right up. Say, do you know about any medical stations nearby? Hmm. The closest is probably the one at Prescott Starbase in Union. And here in Cedo? You're kidding, right? Out here, no one ever cared about infrastructure like that. Not even during the war. I understand. Thanks anyway. No problem. How sad. Okay, don't need a repair. Don't need a restock. They have five. Allows you to pull multiple objects and increase the speed at which items can be pulled. Huh. Okay. Let's launch and go back. Dax, come in, Dax. Any news? So I just bought the STA, and guess what? There are no medical stations out here. I told you we would come across something with enough time. I don't have time. Why am I getting the feeling you're just using me to beef up your crappy station on the cheap? Listen, I didn't have to take you in or stick your friend in my freezer. I'm trying to help you, but we gotta do it my way. With patience and under the radar. This is taking far too long. Uh -oh. For people like us, it is what it is. There are no shortcuts in the DMZ. You still there? Talk to me. Yeah, I'm here. A delivery convoy for G&B just jumped in. All automated, barely guarded, and completely packed. I'll be damned if they're not hauling a medical pod. Them. 
time then. Remember what I said about being boring? This is sticking your fingers in the faces of the very people we want to avoid. I'm sorry, Dax. My friend is in trouble, and this is my chance to help him. The convoy's AI-driven. There are just a few guards. I might even manage to steal the meds without any trouble at all. I don't like it. If this operation goes south, it's on you. In your head alone. Got it? Yeah, I get it. It's been like that all my life. Sitting inside. Thing. I can't use that. I get this, then it's gonna be the last thing I do for this game at least. I'm gonna eat dinner and then probably come back and try to play something. Dang, that's so far away. I wonder if it counts on quicker the quicker it loads. Oh what LS leaves. down a bit. This should give me a few seconds. Supposed to. What am I supposed to do? Open. Five barrels of socks. Great. <laughs> Five barrels of socks. Dang. Okay. I almost got caught. for medical equipment. Great. Dax? Yeah? I just found the med pod, but for some reason it's under higher security. 
Do we have lock breakers in our hangar? If I can get this thing to base, I might be able to crack it. We may have something. But how are you planning to move an entire pod through super light? I am not. That it will do all by itself. Just have to get my hands on that main server. And this isn't gonna be suspicious to anybody. Can I actually open up all these cargo things? that what the hell were you thinking you know we're trying to keep a low profile how did you reroute this thing anyway with my GMB signature look I had to do something for Ben it'll be fine you'll see I'm gonna be able to track you I mean, huh? I'm not happy about this at all let's see what you got then There's a whole medical lab in here. We can strip it for parts and ditch the vessel somewhere after. Well? <laughs> Looks like you've gone... and stolen yourself a doctor. <laughs> this needs off my base now, before she wakes up. Eject that thing! Hey, hold on. What were you saying to me earlier about trusting a little? Trust is something hard to come by in the DMZ. Don't abuse it. How are you so sure she'll turn Dang. us in? Cause she's GMB! She'll reveal our location the first chance she gets. I'm GMB. She's a doctor. We can persuade her to help us. For Ben's sake. Well, you are a clone. I shouldn't expect you to understand human behavior. Let's think about this. We thaw her out and have her decide. If she won't help us, we freeze her again and <coughs> drop her off near some GNB outpost. 
You don't understand what's at stake. Why I needed to come back here. That medical popsicle could jeopardize everything. Well, if there's more to this, then you need to tell me what it is. There's something of great value in the DMZ. It's the reason I've been waiting all these years. One big, easy job. It could be my ticket out of here. And yours, too, if you could just play along. Just be... Well, I'm intrigued. Come on up to the control room, and I'll explain. I got a transmission through to my colleague, Maddox. He's on Prescott Starbase, in the Union system. But I can't use the jump gate. You could help me with this. And that's where this mysterious job is? Not quite. Like I said, it's where Maddox is. There are others involved, and I can't do the job without them. Look, who are these colleagues of yours? And what is this job anyway? All you need to know right now is that it's a time-sensitive operation, and it'll be worth your while. Okay. So you want to use the jump gate? Exactly. And your GMB signature can get me through. Look, I know you want to know more, but... It's too dangerous. I like you. And I'm offering you the biggest opportunity of your life. And I'm willing to go along with your plan with the ice nurse in the hangar, up to a point. If she proves difficult, I want her out in the vacuum. Find me a way to Prescott Starbase, and you'll get your ticket out of the DMZ. Mm. Okay. Okay. Thanks to the new scanner, we can now reach far deeper into the system. I just had to scan the vicinity of Norea. This is what came up. Good old Grady and Brunt. Maybe you could snatch us some spare jump keys from your old buddies. Uh, I can't head back to my former station, but maybe Nephthys planes could work. If they don't recognize your signature as the one that just raided their distribution port. You're giving their databases too much credit. Some weeks ago, a controller sold out his entire team to Scavengers. And when I left, he was still listed as Employee of the Month. All right. <laughs> but before you go, you need to promise me one thing. What's that? Okay. If you can't get the keys, come back here and we'll figure out something else. Just don't bring back an entire team of Frozen Gate engineers. 